Hello everyone, this is Ron from iTech Legion and this is part of a review of the Nier 12 Platinum Software Suite. And once again, here we are back to the welcome screen of the Nier 12 Platinum Launching Pad. And we are going to take a look at the Nier Recode Utility. See here, we just launched the program. And uh, this program essentially allows you to quickly convert files especially if you're the kind of person that uh, always watches media on your phone, on your mobile devices, or uh, just simply uh, you want to convert files so you can work on them or upload them to uh, YouTube or other uh, online video services so it's uh, just, uh, you don't uh, use too much bandwidth in doing that. So you can see here there is a drag and drop function. You just uh, open your folder, source file here. So I have my sample video here. Just drag and drop and you can see that it detects the file size, the audio codec, and the video codec immediately and also you have your option here when you convert it. If you notice that the file size is drastically smaller than what the original encoding was of course and that is basically another uh, good thing about you having to use the other code and also you have the options here to change the profiles. You have 3GP for your phones, you have AVI, FLV, Flash Video, MKV, MPEG-2, MPEG-4, and WMV. And by default, it's MPEG-4. You can also edit the profile once you want. You have an encoding uh, with fast pass or high quality tool pass. Of course, that will increase, or increase the file size. You have your aspect ratio change, all the other options here. Frame rates, resizing method, the interlace if you need to resize it. And your resolution if you need to decrease it. I have the, uh, the source is 1080p, we don't need to change it leave it at that you can make it smaller of course for depending on the destination but also here and more importantly you do the hardware acceleration if you have the appropriate hardware click on that so that uh, it's much faster you see it says uh, change the predetermined uh, predefined profile it's valid it's valid for this job only if you need to change it of course you need to save that profile so click yes and you have select which quality you have fit to target very good good moderate low Oh, even uh, let's see what very good file size is. Even uh, setting it to very good, you can see the file size is still a lot smaller than the 1.64 gigabyte source, the 227 megabytes. So let's uh, select a good. You can see 171 and uh, moderate is 97. And I can uh, low is probably, as you can see, it's 60 megs. So that is quite dramatic. I would say good is uh, good enough. And if in case you want to split the file into multiple size so you can fit it into a DVD 9, DVD 5 or even a CDR option here you can select that so we don't need to since we're going to do this for online back it up and it shows you the path to where to save it as let's select actually the drive we're going to output it to I think we can review it here you have a near 12 near 12 videos there you go settings and we are ready to click of course OK and then you see that uh, it has a job list here at the bottom where you can add more files or just uh, since we're not encoding anything else we just do this one and you can see that option here says uh, there is uh, an option here that you tick the box where it shuts down the computer immediately or hybrid computer immediately in case you uh, uh, you want to do this overnight and you just you don't want to be up and wait for it to shut down your computer, you can automatically set Neo Recode to shut down your computer or hibernate your computer for you. So let's start, click start encoding. See how fast a single 1080p 1.64 gigabytes can be converted. As you can see, it is quite quick. We have also um, from the uh, let's we have checked the hybrid acceleration box, so it should be a lot faster. And as you can see, there's also more options in there for recoding. You have your uh, Blu-ray, you import Blu-ray, AVC, HD, or uh, import DVD, and of course uh, your conversion as well. As you can see, it was finished. It was quite quick. And uh, let's see, let's play back it. The output. Hello everyone, this is Ron from High Tech Region, and this is part of our review of the new Let's minimize the audio here. As you can see, that it is. Uh, almost as good as I don't even know any uh, quality uh, I, I barely notice a difference between the original and the version which is well one tenth or less than that in file size so that is quite remarkable